Hello friends. Let's listen the story The Crane and the Crab. Once upon a time, there lived a crane near a pond. As time passed, he grew older and weak and was unable to arrange his food. He then thought of a plan to get access to food without having to hunt for it. He sat on the bank of the pond with a sad face and soon enough the fishes crabs and other creatures in the pond intrigued by his behavior asked him what was the matter in response he explained that an astrologer had made a prediction that the pond would dry up soon and that all the creatures of the pond would die due to the loss of water Hearing this all the creatures of the pond got scared and started talking among themselves then they asked the crane for a suggestion to this problem to which the crane explained how each one of the creature could be saved by a simple action he told all the pond creatures that he would carry one of them in his beak every day and transport them to the other pond nearby which had plenty of water hearing this all the pond creatures agreed immediately in the desperate attempt to save their lives soon enough every day one fish or an other pond creature started getting into the crane's beak as an attempt to save their lives and the crane would take them to the deserted area and devour them one day It was the crab's turn to get on to the crane. He climbed on to the crane's back as the crane flew over the deserted area. The crab immediately saw the skeletons of many fishes and pond creatures lying down. The crab was very clever. Sensing danger, he came up with a quick plan. Before the crane could set him down on the ground and start to devour him, he grabbed the crane's neck with his strong claws and killed him instantly. He then returned to the pond, explaining the entire situation to the remaining pond creatures. They all applauded him for his timely action and wits. Friends, do write your views about the story The Crane and the Crab in the comment section. If you like this podcast, then click the like button and also share it. See you soon in the next story. Stay tuned with the series for listening more Panchtantra stories. Take care and bye.